How's it going guys and welcome back. In this video, we're going to be checking out how we can unlock every single one of the switch skills in Monster Hunter Rise. To start off, we need to know that each weapon type has three different switch skills available to you. And very quickly, for those of you who are still just jumping into the game, what switch skills are essentially is the opportunity to change out a certain attack with that weapon type for a different attack. So without wasting any more time, let's jump straight into this. The first switch skill we unlock for all weapon types at the same time. We can unlock these first switch skills for all weapon types by two different methods. The first one would be to get our village quest rank to 3 star or above. These are the quests on the outside, the single player quest. Or we can also get the gathering hub quest to 2 stars or above. These are the co-op, the indoors quests. So once we've met either of those requirements, we simply go inside and speak with Master Utsushi. And this will unlock the first switch skill for every weapon type. To equip or change any of your switch skills, all you need to do is go to any item box and here you can change up your switch skills at will. Now unlike the first set of switch skills which was unlocked for all weapon types at the same time, the second set of switch skills are going to be unlocked individually for each weapon type. And the way to do this is actually fairly straightforward. What we need to do is go to the blacksmith and forge 7 or more unique weapons or upgrades. This pretty much means just forge or upgrade any 7 weapons inside one same category and then go and speak with Mata Utsushi again, and this will unlock the second switch skill for whichever category of weapon type you was forging. So you'll have to do this with each weapon type individually to unlock each of their switch skills. Now the third and final switch skills for each weapon type is going to be, of course, the hardest to unlock. First of all, we'll need to get the Inside Gathering Hub quest rank to 4 stars, and once we have 4 stars on these co-op missions, we go and speak with Master Utsushi, and this will unlock 4 special quests, which we can accept by going to the counter here inside the co-op area, and each one of these 4 quests we just unlock will be associated with a specific weapon type, and when we complete that and go back and speak with Master Utsushi, it will unlock the 3rd tier switch skill for that weapon. Now you may have noticed that there's actually only four different categories here. We have the Sword and Shield, the Hunting Horn, the Switch Axe, and the Light Bowgun. So you're probably asking yourself, where are the rest of the weapon types? Well, as you can probably imagine, they're going to be on the higher star rank. So when we reach five stars in the same co-op area, we can go back, speak with Master Shushi, and it will unlock the side quest for the Great Sword the hammer, the lance, the charge blade, and the heavy bowgun. And finally, once we reach 6 stars in the co-op hub, we'll be able to do the side quest for longsword, dual blades, gun lance, insect glaive, and the bow. Of course, once we finish any of these side quests, we need to go and speak with Master Sushi to unlock each one of these, and then we'll have them so we can change them around freely, like we said before, by going to the item box. So that is how we can unlock every single one of the Switch skills. I hope you did find this video helpful, guys. If you did, don't forget that thumbs up button, subscribe for more content coming very soon, and we'll see you next time.